Conroy here. Uh, you know, I'm not one of those guys who really produces a lot of fancy stuff. I just want to get to the solution as fast as possible. And also, it, it, you know, I'm lazy. So there's my truck. I have a, we also have a 2014 Ford Flex. If your Ford Flex is trying to start and trying to start, but it won't start, it sounds like it's got plenty of electricity to keep this, turn the engine over, but it won't start. It's a fuel problem in, you know, that's pretty basic, but this other guy on YouTube pointed it out, $50 part. Okay, it's not 50 anymore, it's $69. But what it is, is the fuel relay. This is it, it's a Dorman part 601-225. And I found one at AutoZone, I had to go to two of them. It was $69. Um, but what you need to do is, you, uh, this is the, what do you call it, the post behind the, the, the back seat door, or the back door. And it is, uh, you just pop this open with a screwdriver. There's a seven millimeter screw back here. Take this screw off and you pop this column off, this little plastic that holds the whole thing on. And that relay is right behind there. And you need a 10 millimeter to unmount the, uh, that fits in uh, these holes, 10 millimeter, and then put it back on, you know, unclip this, clip it back in, and you're done. Put that in, put this back on, but you're back on the road. And it's this relay that quits. So that's what your problem is, it's not the fuel pump, um, unless I'm wrong. Let's see how this goes. I'm gonna be really happy if this guy solved my problem. So kudos to him, I'm gonna leave a link to his site too, or his uh, video. But, uh, damn, YouTube, man, you guys saved me a lot of time and money, Mr. YouTube. Good luck. Okay, I just pulled this out on the bottom. That came out real easy. And then this pulls off. There you go. A couple of tabs up here. Grab it around the back. Wiggle jiggle it off. Get it off. Because we're desperate. We don't want to pay a tow truck. Or have AAA and wait here an hour to two hours and three hours on a Saturday. Well, it's a Saturday, it's Friday night. Okay, we'll okay, get this out. You just had a yank on it with two hands and it came out. So there's the fuel relay right there. So let's unplug it, change it out, and hope this solves the problem. You can see that's the back window. There's the back of the car. So it's in this column right between the rear door and the uh, big window. It's a 2004, excuse me, 2014 Ford Flex. Okay, I'm gonna cheat. I just pulled that out of there. All I did was press this down and it slid right out. I'm gonna leave this one on here, just plug this in and try it and see if it works, right? Let's try it instead of spending a bunch of uh, time on these nuts and bolts. I will be happy to do that once it works, but let's prove it okay, first. The new relay is on, click here, click in there. And let's okay, try it. so uh, there was a little bit of gas left in there, I think when my wife was trying, cause it's fired a second net, won't fire at all, was when it totally quit on her. So I think we ran the fuel out of the fuel line coming up to the carburetors. So probably have to uh, spin this up a couple, you know, a little bit of uh, time to get the fuel up there. Let's see how it goes. Cross your fingers with me, will ya? Okay. Oh my God, it started right away. That solved the problem. That is freaking incredible that Mr. YouTube, and I'm gonna link his channel, what a dude. I'm gonna click on his link where you give him some money and I'm gonna give him some money because he saved me a lot of time and trouble on a Friday night. I just love it, I just love it. This is changing the world and I'm not being, uh, I'm not exaggerating or being whatever. It really makes a big difference to be able to do these things by yourself with, you know, click and snap parts that you can pick up at your auto zone or wherever the hell you're going. So, um, hope things go for you as well as it just did for me. When you run into trouble, it's not about, you know, not getting knocked down. We're going to get knocked down all the time. It's how we get up and, uh, you know, analyzing the problem first is like, it's gotta be fuel, you know, cause, uh, it's got the spark. So everything's cool. I'm going to call my wife and she can uh, have my daughter come pick up the car and uh, everybody will be on their way. And then, yes, I'll put it back, back there like it goes, you know. I'm sure I'll get to that. All right, everybody, have fun out there. Five minutes later.
yes, I did put it back together. Boom, bang, snap, screw, done.